Hi, I'm Bill Blair for Moments in Time. The lives and contributions of those who fought for the South are only vaguely remembered and largely uncelebrated today, but that was not the case in the Covington of 1906. Hardly a family, North or South, was untouched by the conflict. Many Confederate veterans were still living only 41 years after that great war. In Covington and throughout the South, Confederate Memorial Day was observed during April of each year. In Covington, living Confederate veterans would gather on Memorial Day ceremonies. The United Daughters of the Confederacy sponsored luncheons for the veterans at the Covington Woman's Club, ceremonies and speeches at the Methodist Church, and the placing of wreaths and flowers by school children on the graves of Confederate soldiers in the Confederate Cemetery. To further honor the Confederate soldier and ensure their memory for posterity, the Jefferson Lamar Camp No. 305 of the United Confederate Veterans raised funds among their membership and the general public. Those funds were contributed to the city of Covington to provide a monument in the city to the Confederate soldier. Covington's Confederate monument was placed here in the middle of the park in the town square. With great pomp and, and ceremony, it was unveiled and dedicated on Confederate Memorial Day, April the 26th, 1906. Today, a Newton County moment in time. Newton County Moments in Time is a production of Blair on the Square, which is solely responsible for its content. For more information on this topic, go to BlairOnTheSquare.com.